Folks, if you never watched one of my product reviews, this is the one to watch. This is the As Seen on TV Pipe Blaster. Stay tuned. Today I'm going to be reviewing another As Seen on TV item. This is the As Seen on TV Pipe Blaster. This is something I saw at the Dollar General store for $20. And from my understanding, it's this gun right here. And you use it by building up pressure into it by pumping it. And then it's good at uh, removing clogs from drains. It says that it's uh, more effective than a traditional plunger or harsh chemicals, and it says that it releases 30 PSI. Uh, I guess that's pressure into the drain or into a toilet to unclog it. So today we're going to test this thing out. I will admit that I saw this in the store the first time uh, about a month or two ago, and I overlooked it because it just looks like something kind of hokey. But I did research this a little bit online and I saw some people having success with similar items. Not this exact one, but similar items. So I thought, eh, I'll give it a try. So today we're gonna test this out on a bathtub, a toilet, and on the sink out in my garage. It says that it's more effective than a traditional plumber. I mean, plunger. I guess if a plumber's carrying a plunger, it's more effective than that plumber. And eh, my head hurts, eh. Okay, let's unbox this little green gun and see what it can do. All right, so we've got some instructions and the gun itself, and we don't need the box anymore. Doesn't seem to be a whole lot of parts here, so that's a good thing. Okay, so I'm not sure what these three different heads are for. I'm not sure if you use them all at once or what. So I will read the instructions real quick, and then I'll be right back with you. From what I can tell, this thing right here is considered a toilet adapter. Hence the curve on there so that you can hold this thing and stick this down in a toilet. This is, called, this is called the large adapter. It's quite large. It's got a rubber ring around the edge of it there, I guess to seal up. And this is called the small adapter. And it's pretty small, we can see here. And it's pretty much all rubber. And to use this thing, it says all you gotta do is just pump it up like this and then pull the trigger. And I can tell you, I really felt that. A lot of pressure came out of that real quick. It says in the instructions, the more you pump it, the more pressure you get. So there's different pressure levels on here. And my thinking is, is why not go for the full pressure when you're trying to unclog something? So that's probably what I'm gonna do. There might be some certain safety things as far as you know, uh, keeping your pipes safe or whatever. I'm not sure about all that stuff. So I'm not gonna speculate on maybe what you should do at home. But for me, I'm gonna be pumping this thing up to full pressure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. All right, let's go unclog some stuff. All right, so for the first time in my adult life, I am purposely clogging up a toilet. Okay, so I've got the toilet clogged. I am going to use full power on this baby. I've got it pumped up, 20 pumps now. Here we go. First attempt was a fail. Don't know if that was my problem or not. I uh, don't know if I had it sealed well enough. I will try to hold this down a little tighter when I do it. I was not holding it down maybe as tight as I should have. 20. Okay. Okay, and that has not unclogged the toilet so far. <laughs> I'll give it another try. 20. All right, third try. I'll give it one more try and I'll go back to my traditional plunger. So that worked on the toilet after four tries. Now we're gonna head to the bathtub and see if it works on a clogged bathtub that's been clogged with hair. I just wanna throw this out here real quick. My bathtub is not the prettiest in the world. We have heavy rust out here in the middle of the country. So it's, just a lot of mineral deposits and that sort of thing, so it's just not really pretty up around the drain. 
can see the water here is just you know a few inches deep right now. About once every two weeks we have to drop some gel Drano in here and it's just really rough on the fixture here. And also we have heavy iron in our water. We do have a water softener and it helps to some degree. I put the big head on this thing, give it a full 20 pumps. Let's see if it clears this hair clog. Got the drain completely covered now and I'm putting a lot of pressure on it. I got 20 pumps in this thing, the max. Let's see what happens. I'm pushing down hard. To me, it sounds like it loosened it up a bit. So I'm gonna give it another one. The drain is still clogged to a certain degree. This time I'm going to use both my arms on this thing and try to hold it down. I think this is the fourth time now. I can tell the tub is not holding water as bad as it was. I think this might be the fifth time and it seems to be draining better every time. This right now is uh, just the shower running like I normally use it whenever I'm taking a shower and the water is not building up. Normally, after about two weeks of hair clogging, this thing is building up water. It's not doing it right now. Okay, so we've tested out the Asion TV pipe blaster in my bathtub and it worked great. The bathtub's draining awesome right now. So now we're in my garage and we're gonna test it out on the sink here in the garage. It's been clogged now for about the past six months or longer, maybe a year. So we're gonna test it out in here and see if we can unclog this nasty, nasty drain. This drain is disgusting. It's where I have pulled sludge and sludge and sludge out of this thing. 20 pumps. Got the hole completely covered. Let's give it another try. Full 20 pumps again. I'm gonna hold this down really hard. Try to seal this up real good. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna try the big head on it. All right, full 20 pumps. Got the big head on now. I'm gonna put a lot of pressure on this. And I'm gonna tell you, this thing's actually knocking me back. It's knocking me off of the drain. That's how much pressure this thing puts off. And it doesn't seem to be clearing this drain. But I'm gonna admit this drain has got a lot of gunk in it. So. I just used the little head on it again and it seemed to kind of bust through some of that gunk. I want to try this a few more times. Oh wow, that time it really knocked some stuff loose. Still going. I think we've done it, or just about done it. I'm gonna fill this up and we're gonna do it a couple more times and see if we can really get that thing cleared. I mean, I'm actually seeing some swirl now and it just drained. It just drained, wow. Right now it's draining as fast as this water's coming out now. This hasn't done this in probably about a year. So at least the last six months. Okay, I'm gonna make a pretty bold statement here today on Tony's reviews. Out of all the As Seen On TV items I have reviewed in the last year, this As Seen On TV Pipe Blaster is my absolute favorite item and works better than any As Seen On TV item that I have used so far. The As Seen On TV Pipe Blaster lives up to its name. It blasts pipes. It does work better than traditional plungers or harsh chemicals. This thing is amazing. No more trips to the store for Drano gel. Everybody, there is an Amazon link in the description and also one of the comments. I suggest you get one of these pronto. Throw out your plunger, throw out your chemicals. This thing right here does it all. In the words of JJ on Good Times, this thing is dynamite. So folks, check it out. You saw it here first on Tony's Reviews. If you want to see some more of my Ask you know, TV product reviews, just click on the above link. Thanks so much for tuning in to Tony's Reviews today, and God bless you.